So breaking, the jury has reached a verdict. The man accused of shooting a Cape Coral police officer at point blank range now knows his fate. Wait, News reporter Wait, Annalise Iraola. We, the jury, finds us all of us to the defendant in this case. Count one. The defendant is guilty of attempted first degree premeditated murder of a law enforcement officer. Wait News reporter Annalise Irola is live at the Lee County Courthouse. And Annalise, emotions are running high. What happened in court when they read that verdict? That's right, Lois. Well, the courtroom followed the judge's instructions and there were no outbursts of emotions or reactions after the verdict was read. And it only took jurors a few hours to come back with a juror with a verdict. Yosa Rivera was found guilty of attempted first-degree premeditated murder of a law enforcement officer. Rivera, now 34 years old, was originally convicted of shooting Officer David Wagner when he was 19 years old. You're looking at dash cam video back in 2011 during the traffic stop. Rivera got a new trial because in the previous one, a circuit court judge failed to give a jury instruction about whether Rivera knew the victim was a police officer. Once the verdict was reached, Rivera showed little to no no reaction, but after court was adjourned, the Wagner family was all smiles and hugs. I spoke with state attorneys Stephanie Russell and Abe Thornburg about their feelings after the final verdict. Relief. This has been a very long time coming. Um, the Wagner family has needed this for a very long time, going on 13 years. Um, there's a lightness all of a sudden, and it's, it feels really good. It's been a, a very long fought battle, and you know, we leave it in the hands of the jury. They got it right, and that's all we can ask for. Rivera is being held without bond, and sentencing is scheduled for March 12th. Live at the Lee County Courthouse, Annalise Iraola, Wink News. Annalise, thank you.